Carly, thank you. Six million dollars will help build dozens of new homes in Grand Rapids. The goal is to have more affordable housing for both renters and people who want to become homeowners. 13 On Your Side's Jeremiah Brown joins us from the newsroom with details. Jeremiah. Julia and Elena, the city says they have a huge task in front of them. The group Housing Next says the city needs over 14,000 new units by 2027 to meet the demand for housing. And every project that moves that needle is in the right direction. The um, most recent housing needs assessment documents um, very significant need for housing, both rental and home ownership at all price points. $6.1 million is on its way to Grand Rapids to help build five new developments across the city's three wards, providing new homes for both buyers and renters. So we know that there's uh, there's funding out there for different types of projects and, and the funding for affordable projects is certainly not enough. These projects are spread out across the city, including renovations of existing buildings, multi-phase developments, a new four-story structure, and the redevelopment of the former Seymour Christian School. The projects that we're supporting here with this grant kind of fall in that below market rate. So some of them are, are serving households at 80% area median income or below, but then they do go down further than that to um, below 60% as well. An increase in affordable housing is expected to help alleviate other problems as well, such as employers looking for new hires. Um, employers are very anxious to see more housing be developed to provide to you know allow opportunities for their employees to to live in Grand Rapids and for them to attract um, new employees and improve quality of life. If you're struggling to afford rent or you're having a hard time getting into home ownership. Um, that just leads to compounded problems um, in, in, uh, in your day-to-day -day life. Gloucester says that anything the city is able to do to help residents be stably housed will have more and more positive effects for the residents of the city. From the newsroom, I'm Jeremiah Brown, 13 on your side.